know you don't like gay things that you don't listen to. Me. <laughs> no, because the gay niggas saved my life one time. This nigga saved me from getting jumped. I was in a club, I was with a girl. Girls always almost get you fucked up because they, they feel like you're supposed to fight the world even though you can't even fight that well. <laughs> I was, I'm my ex-girlfriend, man. She, she had a big room, whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna go back into the story. So we was out, and we was out, and uh, we was out, like in another country we went into uh, this bar. We didn't know that the bar was kind of gay because it's like everybody, <laughs> everybody party together. So we didn't really know. So it was kind of packed. And you know, I'm, I'm LA. When I'm in LA, I can get to the drinks fast. But I'm, so I'm in another country. I'm trying to do the same shit. So I'm moving motherfuckers out the way to try to get a drink. And I bump into this gay nigga. And he was like, bitch. And he got mad. And I was. <laughs> Just bumping on me, nigga. I was like, shit, I'm sorry. You're right, I'm sorry. Let me buy you a drink. That was the best thing that ever happened. Bought him a drink. Fast forward, me and my girl, we drunk, and I guess not a gay nigga touched her ass. And she was like, baby, did you see that? I saw it, but I act like I did. I didn't want to have to fight. I just act like, I just turn my head and just start drinking. She's like, baby, did you see that? I was like, no, I didn't. What, what happened? <laughs> she was like, he touched my ass. I was like, really? Damn. Well, if he does it again, because I didn't think it was going to happen again. But this time, this nigga came back and grabbed her ass. And I was like, mother, you know, I, then I had to do something, you know what I mean? Like, I was like, motherfucker, don't ever grab my girl ass. I, you know, you get that real, I'll fuck you up. <laughs> and he wasn't scared. He just looked at me and was like, what? And he was like, sure. And five niggas came out of nowhere. Like, what you say? And I was like, fuck. And I got to fight. And my girl is like, get him. And I'm like, oh. so I said, all of these motherfuckers got to fight? <laughs> When you, get, when you mean get them per se, what do you mean? <laughs> per se! Right? So I'm like, fuck, but I'm in it. I gotta fucking stop this got fight now. She's standing there, nigga, grab her fucking ass. I'm ready to fight. The gay dude comes out of nowhere. He's just like, is there a problem? Is there a problem? <laughs> is there a motherfucking problem? Right? <laughs> And then I was like, yeah, motherfucker, right? And he was like, shoop, shoop. And the whole club that was gay came and stood behind this nigga. It was like 30 gay niggas. Right? And I'm standing there, and I'm like, we about to win. So now I didn't turn into a straight gay nigga. I'm behind all of them like, yeah. <laughs> I get in the car right, with my girl. I'm still in character. Still <laughs> in character. She like, what the fuck was that? And I was like, bitch, first of all. 